What up guys and welcome to a new video. Today we're going to react to a Jubilee video and this video is titled Blind Dating Six Men Based on the Outfits. So let's jump right in and let's react. What kind of dancing that we do? Like swing dancing? Ballroom dancing? I can do a little salsa. Just a little bit. So. Mm. It's not very good, but you know. It'll work. We can work on that. She cute though. There's definitely a mixed race of guys behind that fucking curtain. We asked just Hi, okay. I'm Jess. I am 21. So I only started getting into fashion really like my senior year of high school. I had to buy all my own clothes, so I got really in. Skip the intro. Let's check the shoes. Ooh. I'm like, like not a huge them. shoe person in general. And they're I probably like the like last thing I think about when it comes to an outfit. But they say that you can tell the most about someone from like their that. shoes. Okay, contestant number two. I like those shoes a lot. Mm -hmm. I would wear those shoes, yeah. <laughs> also, um, contestant number four. Those are pretty nice. I'm curious what's gonna accompany the rest of those. I can't really tell too much off the bat, so. What kind of music is everyone into? My favorite genre is probably like rap, like Kanye, new album Donda. I also listen to like pop, like Ariana Grande. Yeah, it, like it, he gets the shoes that, you know, complement that type of fucking music, yeah. Your gex. I'm a producer. I make a lot of music from different genres. Anything from like reggae to hip hop to house music. I'm a big R&B guy, but I definitely like to mix it up with alternative music as well. I was this guy, this guy right here is yelling. Basically just yelling out. I listen to, um, uh, Frank Sinatra at night. Rock, my favorite bands are Sad Girl and uh, a band called Max Hill. But also a lot of like old corny music like Frank Sinatra, Dean Martin. I fucking knew it! Oh my god! I fucking knew it! How the fuck did I know that, bro? That is crazy! <laughs> that is crazy! That is the craziest thing I've ever done. What? How the fuck, bro, the shoes are so old school, bro. That's why I was like, bro, he listens to some fucking old shit, like Frank Sinatra or some shit. That is crazy. But also a lot of like old corny music, like Frank Sinatra, Dean Martin, Bobby Darren. I'd say, uh, but I, I'm not gonna complain. Frank Sinatra is the GOAT, bro. He's one of the best. Uh, favorite band, Rolling Stones, and favorite artist, Otis Redding. I like Thundercat and Prince. Prince is obviously the best musician of all time. So, you know, there's that. Prince is cool. MJ is the greatest. Calm the fuck down with you, Michael Jordan. Now I don't like that guy. Okay, let me, let me go back. Eliminate, go back. eliminate the last guy right I'm there. I'm going to have to eliminate, very sadly, contestant number one. Because he's generic. He's generic. Hi. Hi. I'm sorry. You, your outfit is amazing, though. You I too, love you it. Too. Thank you. What happened to your face? Oh, it's just Nelly inspired. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> well, this is cool. <laughs> My guy thought he was the Korean Nas, bro. Or some fucking shit. Can I look now? <clears throat> Ooh, okay. Contestant number five is not what I was expecting at all. I don't know. I, I just expected him first to be wearing like pants or like something more athletic. I like it though. I like the colors a lot. Cool I'm very into that, it. That's for sure. Contestant number three is kind of what I expected. I also liked his music choices too, so very promising. Can I ask everyone a question now? Okay, where would we go on our first date and what would we be doing? Definitely love to go on a drive, probably somewhere like near the coast, you know, get that like nice ocean breeze. Afterwards, I would love to like show you some of my music and maybe cook you something if you're done. Okay, so um, I like to go out to like overlooks and, and cliffs and just kind of like watch the stars or just, just uh, chill in the car and then talk and like we'll really get to know you. Okay, so for me, I consider myself- Okay, he might say something really, you know, old school stuff, you know, some classy shit. Not the, the things that these guys said. Stuff like a big romantic. Definitely gonna take uh, you out to dinner. Maybe a place yeah. I haven't tried before or somewhere that I know that's really good. And then maybe go like dancing or... What kind of dancing? I told you. We do like swing dancing, ballroom dancing. Oh, I no. can do a little salsa, just a little bit, so. That's what mm. we saw in the intro. It's not very good, but you know, nah. it'll work. We can work on that. I'd probably take you for a ride out to my favorite spot on uh, Angel's Crest Highway and we probably would have a picnic there and 
after than uh, an art museum. What would you drive us to the spot in? A motorcycle, if that's oh, okay. Yeah, I've never been on the back of a motorcycle, actually. There's always a first. I would choose a drive-in movie. I drive a truck, so I've got a pretty impressive drive-in movie set up. Air mattress, blankets, pillows, picnic, all of that, all set up. Preferably a horror movie, if you're into that sort of thing. Ooh, I, do I love like horror, horror movies. movies. Who's, who's she kicking out? Who's she kicking out? The second one right there. The two? Oh, I only had one. Two guys. Who did I think? The last guy and the second guy. The two? Oh, last guy and second I only guy. had one. Okay. To rethink now. I'm gonna eliminate contestant number two. Fucking do it. And the last guy. Just... Hi, Jess. <laughs> nice sorry. to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm sorry, your answer no, was just fine. not what as was dramatic. I'm Perfect, Jess. Bro. Yeah, Perfect. it was the answer, so it's okay. Yeah. Right. Last guy. So now it's going to be contestant number two. Yeah. Am I missing? Okay, it's probably the dancing. Okay, it's probably the dancing. Yeah. Oh, sorry. No. Oh my god. Oh my god. This guy looks like the fucking eighties, like the nineties, bro. This guy is definitely, bro. I did expect he was white, but I did not expect the stash, the fucking mullet, bro. This guy is definitely the epitome of fucking, you know, that old school times of white people. You know what I mean? Hey. It's really good. I'm Jess. I'm Jess. I nice love your you. outfit so Thank much. Thank you. Though. I appreciate it. And about the sustainable fashion, I work mm -hmm. at a thrift store. Really? Yeah. So oh, I'm like... That would have been a power couple. Okay, the top. What's the last part? Accessories on the head? I feel like the tops definitely match the pants. I still really like the outfit on the end. You have a really cool style. Yeah, I like the, cool the leather jacket the goes with the motorcycle, goes with the rock music. It's all making sense now. Yeah. Oh, nothing about me? I, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> it looks Why'd very, like, comfy. I see maybe a little bit of a chain. I like that. Where do you see yourself in five years? Above, right? I am leaving in about six months uh, to Asia. I'm starting a business project in the Philippines with my friend. We are developing affordable housing for pretty much anyone around the world to be able to vacation. I'm trying to, you know, make it more accessible for people to be able to visit beautiful places. Oh, that's a great answer. That's cool. Yeah, it's super sweet. I like that. <laughs> oh my gosh, she just skipped him. Probably tattooing and traveling at the same time. Currently, I'm doing a tattoo apprenticeship down in OC. Who do I think she picks? The guy in the middle. Hopefully, that will give me opportunity there's to travel like, and work at no the same time. Right right I just figured, and it was in New York. I'm printing out cars personally. Cars are my passion, so. What's your dream car? Ooh, that's a hard. That's I'm a big. This is where he's gonna say like Bugatti, Bugatti, bro. Mercedes Benz guy. I worked for them for about four years, so maybe. Benz, okay. I would say maybe an SLS Gull Wing. I think the first person I'm gonna eliminate is contestant number two. What is going on? I've, I'm wrong now two times. I was really good on that Frank Sinatra one though. Hi, hey. I'm Jess. Nice to meet Morrow. you. Morrow, pleasure to meet you. Wait, what is it? Morrow. Morrow, nice pleasure to meet you. Too. I like your jacket. Thank you, I like yours too. Thank you. Give me 30 seconds, give me 30 seconds, I think. <laughs> <laughs> this is really tough. <laughs> I feel like I like both their outfits in different ways. So now I gotta think back to the answers. She's gonna pick, I'm gonna she's gonna pick the first one. Eliminate contestant number two. I'm so sad about it though. <laughs> It's all good. Um, hi, I'm Jess. Nice to meet you, Jess. Quinn. Quinn, nice to meet you too. Sorry, it's very narrow. It's very <laughs> close. <laughs> hey, I'm Jess. Hey, what's up? Nice meeting you. What's your name? Taryn. I'm honestly really excited about what you're doing in the future with sustainable oh, fashion. Oh, thank you. That's I liked really what cool you were going to do. Like, your plan for five years, I was very into it. Awesome. 
I'm just impressed over my fucking prediction about the Frank Sinatra stuff right there. I'm I'm more impressed about that, and uh, I'm gonna tap myself in the fucking shoulder right there and my and the back, and I'm gonna just say, that's the best thing. That's the best prediction. I don't give a fuck about the ending. Who cares? Because I fucking predicted the Frank Sinatra shit, bro. Who cares? <coughs> COVID. Anyways. With that being said, though, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We're not going to watch the fucking last 30 seconds of this shit. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys um, hit the like button, you know. you know, Help me out a little bit. Leave a comment down below which, uh, which fit you thought was, you know, the coolest. In my opinion, I'm not going to cap. Even though I don't like shorts, the fucking last guy was cool, bro. He had some fuck. That shirt right there was pretty cool with Jesus and stuff. Anyways, with that being said, though, we're done. And I hope to see you in the next video. Deuces.